This video describes diamond plots. They're new in Stat Graphics 18. A diamond plot is a dot plot to which a diamond shape has been added to show the confidence interval for the population mean. Typically, we'll pick a confidence level such as 95%, which means that the diamonds we plot will cover the true population mean 95% of the time. They're useful when you need to summarize a single sample. They're also good for comparing multiple samples. You can also add a diamond to a box and whisker plot. Again, it shows the potential estimation error in the population mean. To show you how to create a diamond plot in Stack Graphics 18, I've loaded into the data sheet a file called body temp. It contains the body temperature and heart rate of a sample of individuals. To create the plot, I'll go to the top menu to plot, exploratory plots, diamond plots, multiple samples. It now asks me how my data is structured. I could have put the data for men in one column and the data for women in another, which would be a multiple data column structure. In this case, though, I've put all the measurements in a single column and created a code column to identify the gender. When the data input dialog box comes up, I'm going to pick a column like heart rate, put that in where it says data, and for level codes, put in gender. When I press OK, the diamond plot will be created. Initially, the confidence intervals are created at whatever level of confidence you've set on your Edit Preferences dialog box. The General tab of the Preferences dialog box on my computer is set to 95%. So the confidence intervals here are 95%. If you want to change the level of confidence, you can go to your diamond plot, push the right mouse button, select pane options, and change the level of confidence, for example, to 99%. I can also create a box and whisker plot by going back to the plot menu to exploratory plots, box and whisker plots, multiple samples. Again, I'll put in heart rate, and for the level codes, I'll put in gender and press OK. I'll take the default tables and graphs, which will create a box and whisker plot for me. To add the diamond to the plot, I can push the right mouse button, select pane options, and check the box that says add diamond. Now I have my 95% confidence intervals for the means. If you'd like diamonds to appear by default whenever you create a box and whisker plot, go to the Edit menu, select Preferences, and then select the tab labeled EDA. You'll see various options for your box plots. Check the box that says Diamond and press OK. Now, whenever you create a box and whisker plot, a diamond will be added to it by default.